it's weird all right it's super weird i'll see some wild shit <laughs> so speaking of this because this is something that's been going on and, I, and i'm glad you brought that up because i'd like to touch on this topic so yeah i get caught when i go smoke a joint downstairs i get caught down the tiktok rabbit hole because i'll just start oh, all the time <laughs> scrolling scrolling. but oh. here's the problem boys it started off Who's with pimple popper it started off with pimple popping. Okay. Okay. Oh no no no! Hang on. It's gonna get much worse. It's gonna get much worse. <laughs> okay. And then I'll let okay. you have your time. But this yeah. has been my guilty pleasure: the tonsil stone popping. Have you guys seen this shit? Because it just popped up I one day. Not. These guys go in and they pop like tonsil stones out of their mouth. So, this is where the story gets a little crazy. Up until. <laughs> At some point, I want to say about three o'clock today, Central Standard Time. I didn't know that I had tonsils. I thought my tonsils had been removed. So I text my mom because these things look like tiny fucking teeth popping out behind people's lips. Like, yeah. Anyways, Lady Dragon's here telling me she pops them out with her tongue. Dan's having a fucking panic attack as a hypochondriac. So I'm sitting there. I'm like, yeah, go ahead. What? I yeah. didn't even know these were a thing. Dude, Google it right now while I'm monologuing. Um, but yeah, so what <laughs> happens is these they hide in the pockets of the tonsils. And so they clean them out. So if you have bad breath and stuff, this is just a buildup that happens in the, in, oh, in yeah, the yeah, pockets. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. You're, you're, you're a lot calmer about this than you should be. Anyways, okay. so I see these fucking videos and then I text my mom as I'm sitting next to Lady Dragon. And I'm like, I had my tonsils removed, right? Because I'm telling I'm telling my wife this. In like fifty percent confidence, like I'm like I, I I vaguely remember someone had their tonsils out in my family. Not don't remember if it's me though. So my mom mm. says nope. So my blood pressure goes that high off the screen. Oh, so I'm sitting there and I'm looking at at Lady Dragon because I'm high as a fucking kite right now, and I'm like, do I have tonsil stones? I've never checked. Like, is this something I'm supposed to check for? Like, this is like when. When you date that one person who didn't know they were supposed to put oil in their car, like it happened once and they thought they were just uh -huh. good for it. And that's it. I didn't want to be the asshole because I'd be like, I'd figure that the dentist would tell me like something in yeah. my life. Because when you see these pimple popping things, and this is the one thing that gets me is that those mother, how long do you let that blackhead get to a point where real. it looks like it's concrete? For real, dude. Like real. even the I didn't know I was pregnant people have nine months before they figure shit out. But you can't tell me that you let that fucking that blackhead go to a point you saw 10 doctors and no one could figure that out. Because the first thing I would have done was get a suction cup and pump that fucking thing out. And that's it. But anyways, it, it weirds me out when I feel things bumpy along. So all I thought of were these little tiny tooth rocks behind my teeth. Because I'm already a smoker in a lot of things. I'm lucky I got the teeth that I have based on everything. But fuck. I sat there and Carrie, the first thing I did is I went upstairs. And I'm I'm re like, I gaggle. Like, I, I have trouble brushing my teeth some days. I can't get my back molars. Like, I just have a really uh -huh. horrible gag reflex. So I take a cotton swab because this is going to go well. We already know I'm off to a great fucking start. <laughs> so Dan's there with a flashlight fucking pot light hidden on me. And I'm in a mirror looking. And I go, call for my wife immediately. Lady Dragon, I need you to pop this for me. Or check them out at least. She's like, well, did you see one? And I says, I don't know. I saw something, but I'm too spooked to see what it was. Because what happens if it comes out? What's my play? I don't know what to do after. It's going to taste gross. It's going to smell gross. And then I'm going to have a cotton swab and I'm going to drop my phone. I can see the outcome of this. And, it, and it's not going to end well for me or my phone. So... I get Lady Dragon to look in my mouth because she is she she was a nurse. She she actually quite enjoys like she when we first met, she used to sit there with a light and stare into my ears looking for blackheads. Mm. Like that is how sadistic my wife is. But anyways, luckily I got someone that's gonna do it for me because we we'll have another conversation Dude, in a bit about I what I asked. No, that was a thing. Dude. I didn't even know that was a thing. Carrie, do you have tonsils? Yeah, I never Fuck. had them removed, yeah. Yeah, go get Evelyn to check that shit, bro. Just... Ah!